Okay, so just want to show you the first thing we usually work on is um, thresholds, uh, boundaries. So teaching kennel and thresholds, so he's not allowed to just run out of the crate. So he kind of knows it. So I have named it already, but also using positive. So Tony kennel. Good boy. He goes in. I shut the door. I open. He doesn't come out. Good boy. Break. Good. So again, Tony Kennel. Good boy. We've already worked on this, as you can tell. He was definitely, uh, had no respect for this threshold. Good boy. Break. Tony Kennel. Good boy. Everything comes off in the crate. I lock the door. I come back. I open the door. I put a slip lead on. Good boys. I feed him as I put the slip lead on. He's not allowed to come. Nope. Good boy. Got to be careful. Don't want any paws getting stuck. No. Boy. Went for a nice long walk. Tony. Good boy. Kennel. Good. Peter. Tony Kennel. Good boy. Uh uh. You're cheating. So I'll apply pressure now. Kennel. Good boy. Now I'm going to feed him instead of um rewarding as he gets in because you can see his butt was halfway out so open the door nope nope good good boys good break good boy so now i'm not going to throw food in there and i'm just going to tell him kennel and apply pressure to the slip leaf tony kennel no pressure pressure good I got the food in my hand. So he's like, huh? What? Kennel? Good. There you go. That's a Michael boy. Break. Good job. Good boys. Tony Kennel? Good boy. Good job. So pressure becomes less and less because he learns that, okay, good boy. Break. Good. So again, Tony Kennel. Good break. Nice job. That's my good man. Tony Kennel? No. Kennel? Good boys. That's a my good boy. Good job. Good boy. Break. Good job.